All right, guys. Uh, hi, this is Tommy212, and uh, again, uh, uh, I will be showing you how to enable your uh, MMS tethering and internet settings on your T-Mobile iPhone 4 or iOS 4.0.1. Um, this has been a problem for a lot of people that um, are trying to use MMS or internet with their T-Mobile unlocked iPhone 4 or 4.0.1 software. Not everybody is uh, having uh, everything working for them, but I guess I'm one of those lucky ones that, has, that is having everything working, and I'll ex try to explain as much as possible on how, on how to do it. Well, first of all, starting from uh, internet settings, you should ne you need a T-Zone, active T-Zone account to um, get your uh, internet working. Anyway, so the first of all, you need to do is you need to go to settings, and you need to go to your uh, APN settings which is going to be journal about I'm sorry not about network and then your APN settings so these are the APN settings you need I will write down this in the description so web.ystream.com and your MMS settings I will write like I said again I will write all these things down in the in the description box for you guys and hopefully it will work now, a lot of people actually said that they cannot find the cellular data network or APN settings in their phone. Well, if you are having that issue, you need to download a software called System Preferences, which is located under Settings. Well, I'll show you right now. This is right, right here, System Preferences 3.0. This will give you the option to actually enter your APN settings. Now, this is not available or doesn't come with the phone right now. You have to download it through the CDM. So uh, basically, there is a, there is a, you need to just search for system preferences in the CDA. I think you do need a, a source for it. I will write down this in the description. Uh, and once you uh, once you download it, it should you know just reboot your phone and you should have this available. And once you have this available, then you just go to uh, home. Uh, not home. Hold on. Applications. Maybe yes. Application general, and then you just tell them. Uh, cellular data network right here so you need to go to phone cellular data network and you just enter right here it will do the same thing now there is another thing you can do I will write down this one uh, website where you can actually uh, just go, so you open your Safari browser go to this website and just pick up your uh, you, uh, reg, uh, your actually uh, native carrier and it will automatically download it uh, I will write down that website in the description as well now this is for internet setting. If it's working just fine for you, you need to reboot your phone, reset the network settings, and then try to enter them. If it doesn't work for you, or once you're done with it, then do reboot your phone and see if it works. Now, one thing there is uh, working for some people, and actually this is something that actually made me able to uh, do the MMS, because internet was fine, was working just okay, but the only thing that was having problem was, was the MMS. So what I did, I went to Cedia and then I was I was looking some you know I was reading the forums and the websites and stuff and I found this one source, which is basically I'll tell you which one is this MMS fix T dash mobile right here T Mobile 4.0 MMS fix. This is you need this to actually get your MMS working. And you need to enter this source. I will again. I will write this source in the description. You need the source for it. Once you get this, just install it. I'm not gonna do it because I've already done it. Um, and uh, then you should see your MMS working. Give it about 15 to 20 minutes. Uh, it took me a little while too. I wasn't sure because uh, uh, I was able to receive te text um, picture messaging, but I was not able to send it until I actually give it like 15-20 minutes and later I try it and it worked. Uh, you can also down, uh, add the sinful very famous as well and it is also available through that as well. And I will write these sources in the description and uh, hopefully that will work for you. Let's see real quick. So sinful repo is that this one uh, right here actually sinful repo um, uh, sinfulphonerepo.com that's the one for that for for T-Zone MMX fix and also you can do, you can do this LEI mobile uh, repo which is beta.leimobile.com forward slash repo forward slash 
Now, I, I will write this down and, you know, you can give it a shot to see if it works for you. Um, and uh, I guess that will be it. Uh, to get the system preferences, let me just show you real quick. The system preferences will be available. Oops, sorry. Actually, it's called extended preferences. Yes, right here. And that comes in as a system preferences for you. So try to down, uh, search for extended preferences and just download it and it will be you will be able to uh, enter your APN settings through it. Again, uh, just check the description for all the settings and I will enter them in the description for you. Again, if you have any more any question, any any uh, concern, please do message me. I tend to respond timely and if I cannot, I will definitely, you know, come back and uh, with a solution for it. Um, if you like my um, channel uh, my videos, please do subscribe me um, because uh, make some more videos. Uh, uh, thanks a lot, and uh, we'll come back with something new for you guys. Take care. Bye.